Mrs. routine lifestyle and environment impacted her health as a unitary being. According to Ali Good, during episodes of bearing resonancy, the human environment field manifestations may be perceived as non-harmonic and unsettling to the person, thus the person may view himself or herself as out of harmony or ill. A nurse practicing based on larger science of unitary human beings would first identify patterns of manifestations. This nurse would help Ms. S engage in the pattern appraisal process to obtain her experiences, perceptions, and concerns about general weakness, shortness of breath, and anxiety. Roger's model of pattern appraisal suggests that the patient reflects upon her personal patterns and on the patterns of those with whom she shares life. Ms. S has been raising her children alone for three years. During this appraisal, the nurse seeks to discover the patient's goal. According to Ali, providing care within the Rosalian model emphasizes the self-articulation of personal pattern manifestations and self-knowledge. Obtaining patient history is also integral to the pattern appraisal. Ms. S has been living in a subsidized house. Her income is insufficient for her family's need, leading to an unhealthy diet. Obtaining vital signs, laboratory, and diagnostic reports are vital. Assessment of rhythm of pain and discomfort and areas of patient concern are also essential. Pain and discomfort alter a human's energy field. Through specific questions, the nurse will assess if Ms. S has experienced a change in her sleep patterns and nutritional intake. The recent diagnosis of end-stage renal disease created a dissonance in the energy field of the patient. This is characterized by changes in her sleep-wake cycle and nutrition. She became anxious about how she could provide for her family if she begins hemodialysis treatment. Dissonance is manifested by her acknowledgement of fear and anxiety regarding her future. The human energy field pattern is integrated with the environment field pattern in this theory. Rogers asserts that the unitary human being and environment are intertwined. The restlessness of the patient while in the hospital was evidence of dissonance between the human and her environment. After the patent appraisal, the nurse can identify Ms. S. goals. This will guide the nurse and the patient to achieve maximum health potential through mutual patterning. The identified goals of Ms. S. are listed here.